We're just chatting we're with Barry chatting. Manilow because we're so excited. He's an icon. He's here. He's amassed a whopping 50, 50 top 40 hits in his career. He's also sold more than 85 million albums. He's been nominated for a Grammy in every single decade <laughs> going back to the 70s. His 30th studio album, This Is My Town, Songs of New York, comes out tomorrow. We're so happy to have him with us today. Barry, good Glad morning. Great to see you. Thanks we're about to do the, like, we're not worthy no, thing no, right no, here. No, no, no. Thank you for having me. This album is really a love letter to New York. And, it is. I mean, you're a New York kid. I I am. Yeah. Williamsburg, Williamsburg Brooklyn. Brooklyn. Which is yeah. the Williamsburg now is like now. The, the hipster place where you go and get kale juice. No, it but is. But not then. No, I mean, taxi drivers wouldn't take me back down, back to Williamsburg. It was too dangerous. Wow. Yeah, that's where I come from. You know, poverty and uh, immigrants and dangerous. That's where I come from. Uh, not anymore, though. But the New York you <laughs> sing about, which songs did you choose? Uh, well, half of it is original songs, right. and half of it is great standards. And choosing these great standards, I had no idea there were that many great standards written about New York by some great songwriters. That took the longest, and then to arrange them so that it made sense for me to sing them. But uh, it, it was great. It, it was great. I, I loved it. It took over a year to do this one because I wanted it to be, to be right. Yeah. You also made headlines recently because you are publicly come out for the first time. The reaction's been incredible. What's it been like for you? It's been great. I mean, it's no, no news to me and no news to everybody around me, family, friends, band. I think even fans. I don't think it was news at all. Uh, but the Inquirer, you know, kind of caught us getting married. And so well, we were stuck. So, so we let People Magazine come on in. But, you know, I'm a private guy. I'm a musician. I, I, you know, yes, fame hit me, but I never really wanted to go on that ride. So I kept my... I kept my dogs to myself. I kept my home to myself, and so this part is uncomfortable. But not, you know, the topic. No, I'm not uncomfortable about that. Gary and I've been together for going on 40 years. 40 years. Man. That's yeah. amazing. Yeah, it's amazing for but, anybody. But you've always let the music speak for you. I mean, I have. obviously, that's where your heart is. That's it. So we obviously have pressured you into singing Copacabana this yeah. morning. I mean, is that the number one song people want to hear? I think so. It is. Why? It's like it's kind of my go-to karaoke song. I, do you sing it? I don't think we call don't, it singing, Barry. No, 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 don't even. They're trying well, that, to cue up the music. No. Well, that's a lot of lyric. I it mean, is a lot of lyric, lot but that's lyric. why it's such a showstopper in karaoke. Uh, the yellow feathers, the dress cut yeah. down to there, the merengue, the cha-cha. Go, cool. yes. Savannah, great. So yeah. do you still enjoy singing it? I do. How could I not? No, it's a great little song. And we, we didn't expect it to be a hit record at all because, you know, those were the days of ballads. I was doing ballads and stuff. And it's such a novelty song. We thought, well, it's a wonderful piece, but, you know, it'll just be on the album and uh, it just exploded by itself you know on the dance charts and stuff it was the biggest surprise and now it's wound up to be you mentioned my name people say Copacabana right. Right? So, after all of those records it's Copacabana 47 yeah. songs in the top 40 it's got crazy. 12 number one hits it's crazy it's unbelievable what a career what a ride it's been it's I, been a crazy ride you're Wonderful. gonna sing for us this morning do you still love connecting with the fans I, like that I do yeah, I do. Um, you know, uh, they're just great people. Uh, you should walk down the street with me someday. These strangers say the most beautiful thing to me. What do they say? Uh, they, they thank me for helping them through uh, their life. The, you know, the impact I've had on people is just Sorry, I'm going to stop. That's cool. No, it's, I read about Bob still, Dylan grabbed you at one point. was like, yeah, hey, Barry, he well, keep you know, doing he, what you're doing. You're inspiring us all. Yeah, I know. He may have been stoned. I can't remember. <laughs> but it was 420 then, too. Yeah, exactly. I believed it. That's all. It's so great to have you, Barry. I don't know if you saw the shot, but your fans are out there waiting in the rain. In they the cannot rain. wait Let's to hear from you. So we're going to get this started just about now. Thank you so much for chatting Thanks, with us. Thanks, Barry. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there. And click Click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.